Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Hello, shark here. <laughs> You're stepping into a war zone. Let's see if you can get your hands on Marcel. Get him, my lad! Get him, my lad! <laughs> He's crying because I'm leaving him. I look so sweaty, so I got a blot, but we're gonna go to a baby. No, yeah, a baby shower. And it's so hot. Yeah, I started the vlog all mad and shit. He's so annoying. He took three hours to get ready. And I told him I have to go to the store to buy the baby the gift, but you know, he don't listen. I already told you, I'm gonna put $30. All right. What's the. <laughs> it's so. He looks, he looks so cute. That looks cute. <laughs> <laughs> this looks cute. My meat. <laughs> oh, Blaze. Fix my brows. We're at the baby shower. Uh, the, 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 little, the little baby. You look all my booger nose. Hey, you're going to do that when you got to do the big green one, too. All day. <laughs> I've been cleaning because I work tomorrow, Friday, all day. Well, not all day. I work three or seven, but I'm going to stay at my mom's house from three. No, I'm going to do laundry tomorrow. You know, La Senora life. But something really like made me laugh and it made Alex really upset because they said it, you know, about me. There was this girl that came on my page and told me that my husband's too good looking for me. But bitch, um, she said he's too good looking for me and I'm ugly and fat and got no neck. Obviously, I ain't got no neck, bitch. I'm fat, but I'm comfortable in my motherfucking skin and I don't give a fuck about what anyone says. But I wanted to tell you guys, if you guys get anything from my videos, anything from my page, from anything that I say, love yourself is what I'm trying to say. Love yourself. Don't give a fuck. Nobody thinks las viejas ardidas are mad that they can't get no dick from your man and they can't get no dick at all. So they're trying to bring you down. But girl, just tell them to fuck off. Um, yeah, I just, I, I it like made me laugh a lot because i'm one to poke jokes at myself so when somebody else talks shit about me it's kind of like girl use a little light for that so if someone's talking shit about you diles buen dia lambe mi culo and have a nice day okay because that just brush it off brush it off and the other thing, uh, my husband is my husband, and you need to back the fuck off, you dirty little hoe. Okay? That's the other thing I wanted to say. It says mio, my... <laughs> um, yeah, because it was just crazy. I was just like, esta pendeja thinks she's gonna hurt my feelings. I've had worse things said to me, <laughs> and I don't give a fuck. But yeah, I just want to tell you guys, if anyone's ever talking shit about you, be less lambe mi concha because they don't matter so this is the way i look and i still got a husband girl so what's up okay also <sighs> these are the best freaking popcorns of life they're spicy <sighs> i've been looking for these i found these last year um and me and my cousin have been searching for these popcorns i even looked them up online they were non-existent but tapatio popcorn Ooh, girl. <laughs> these are delicious so i found these at ross for 249 but if you guys find them anywhere come <laughs>
Yeah. 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 So you guys just saw the clips of like partying and stuff. <laughs> but we went to Rizzo's new bar. That's what it's called. And then next door was like a really good place, girl. It was like popping. It was like all Spanish music, reggaeton, um, like hip hop. So you know, I was getting my groove on with my mans and stuff, and it was really fun. I hadn't had fun, and I didn't drink at all because I was driving home. Um, and it was like the first time I've gone out without drinking that I've had like real fun. I mean, I usually have fun because I already know I'm crazy without the liquor. So I went out. We went out. It was my sister's birthday, and we was all turned into up or whatever. Um, but I haven't really been vlogging because I've been working a lot. Um, so I took f Sunday off and I worked Friday and Saturday. So that's why I was just like not doing anything. Um, and my family actually got to see my wedding video that I made that YouTube took off already. Um, so they got to see my wedding video. My sister cried. So Wednesday I get to show it to my other sister because she was um she was home and it was already late. So she, I was like, you don't got to come over and I'm going to show my dad. Um, yeah, he broke his leg. Crazy. He's getting surgery tomorrow. So tomorrow's his birthday. He's getting surgery. Mira. Lucky him. But yeah, so my dad hurt his knee and he's getting surgery at 8 in the morning. So I'm going to try to get there before he goes to the <clears throat> to the hospital. Um, so before he goes to the hospital, Alex text me why you love mommy you wanted he wants attention so yeah so he, <laughs> what what buddy you guys see how veiny i am but yeah so i got i got a trip because i go over there early in the morning alex drops me off uh i start work at 11 and he drops me off around 7 or 8 in the morning so then he could go to work I don't drive yet. I've been driving by myself, girl, though. I've been driving by myself. I took the car by myself for the first time. I don't know if I told you guys. And I w it was, like, insane. Like, I just grabbed the car and I was like, Skrr! So, yeah. Um. Uh, I haven't put make. Oh, yeah. I did my first, like, makeup, makeup. Like, I got, well, I got paid for makeup before. But this was, like, my actual job. You know, it was, like, in my new house. Like, the first time I did someone's makeup that I got paid for. So, that was really cool. Her, um, it was Magali's friend. But she's a cool ass girl, no thing. She's really nice. She was funny. It was, like, it was, like, natural. Like, what's up, girl? Come on in. Sit on the chair. Have some water. Um yeah and this nail polish is by kiss <sighs> i feel so like it's so hot in here now i um again like the other clip that I, oh my god look it he's like touch me mom look <laughs> look at him he just wants attention he's crazy look i'm gonna stop <laughs> Well, you crazy boy. Yeah, I was good about to get another dog, but Alex was going to kill me. So <sighs> he said when we get a bigger place, I could get Moose friend. Right? You're going to get a friend? And he did rip up our blinds. He ripped up the blinds right here. Remember? You ripped that up. So he ripped, I got to replace those now, and I got to replace the carpet, which we haven't done. Look at him. He said, Mom, pay attention. But yeah, my earring is really hurting, you guys um it's been hurting like insane like how much it hurts like when i pulled my shirt the other day and i pulled it oh my god my whole body hurt so alex said it's infected he wants me to take it off and just get it re-pierced but i don't want to i'm just gonna try to clean it and then get the other one i want right on top of it what but yeah me and mom are just waiting for dad <sighs> but yeah all right I think this is gonna be the end of the vlog, or maybe I'll vlog a little bit later um, before I go to bed.
know it's been a while since I posted, but a lot of things have been going on in my life. I'm cooking chorizo right now. Well, not my life, but like my whole family. Dirty dishes. <laughs> um, and I've been working a lot. Well, not a lot, but just like switching days and it's taking a toll on my body. Um, so, basically, I think two weeks ago or last week, my dad um, broke his knee and he had to have like surgery, like crazy surgery. Um, so, we've been dealing with that, all that, and you know, he's older and I was just scared of him to go into surgery really like scared so um and he's not in the best shape you know he's a smoker he's a drinker and um i was just worried about him so i it didn't really like make sense for me to pick up the camera while we were at the hospital or where i was seeing him because why you know so um i've been dealing with all that plus work I don't vlog at work because I don't want people to know where I work. My favorite coffee right there, $7 at Target. Um, so yeah, I haven't really done anything. Um, you know, it's, it's kind of personal. I don't know if um, uh, I wanted to talk about it before. You guys, I have not slept in a long time. There's just so much going on. Last month, this month, next month, the next few months are going to be rough. Uh, so, you know, I'm just trying to keep it together. I, there's been times I just want to give up, like, give up. Like, I can't. <laughs> but then I think about me being selfish. And I have to pull through it. So, um, yeah, today's Monday, the 20th. I haven't vlogged in like a week and a half, maybe. Um, and I know I'm not a consistent YouTuber, but I, I decided I'm not doing YouTube for the money or to become famous. I'm just doing YouTube for you guys and me. This keeps me sane, like editing videos, vlogging, like this keeps me sane. <laughs> so yeah, I ran into an old friend. Well, not old friend, kind of old friend now. Um, it's more like she's an acquaintance than a friend. She used to be one of my best friends, but you know, things happen and you just stop talking and I'm not really the person that's gonna be begging you for your friendship. Like, it is what it is. We had a good time and there's people that are meant to stay in life. There's people that are meant to be temporary. So I think she was just a temporary person. We're acquaintances now, which is crazy, but I mean, I can't fake being a fake friend. I can't do that. I can't be a fake friend. Um, and yeah, my circle's really, really small now. It's literally like three people. <laughs> uh, like five. But you know, you go from being in high school, having all these friends, and then college comes, you narrow them down, and then you turn, you're about to turn 30, and you barely have any friends. Your friends are your family, so... It is what it is. I feel better like having a smaller circle, less things to worry about, less drama, less whatever. Um, because, you know, as you go older, you see the more problems that life throws at you. And you're just like, I cannot handle this. Um, yeah. So me, I'm getting my hair done in two weeks, which is it's really bad. Um, but I'm going with Bernice. We already made, um, she's my coworker. We already made an appointment, so we're going together on the 30th. So maybe I'll vlog me and her a little bit there. Um, but yeah, you guys, I can't sleep past 5 in the morning anymore. Um, Saturday, Alex actually turned off my alarm. Because I put my alarm for 5, so you know, I wake up, drink my coffee, clean the house a little bit. Do, like, stupid stuff. So he turned off my alarm on Saturday. Like, I had no alarm, but my body woke up at 5.02. Like, I couldn't sleep anymore. Um, and it sucks. And I think I have the same thing my dad has, like, ins insomnia. Or, like, lack of sleep. Because, whatever. I'm just happy my dad's okay. He's in pain. He won't be able to walk for three months. I think. Three or four months. But we're all going to be there for him, obviously. 
Um, I have a lot of time off work, so, well, I have a lot of days off, but they're going to be changing in the next few weeks. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm making my maturity, so hold on. Okay, so I have a lot of, like, off days, but I work a lot of long days. I think we're going to eat blueberries. Who likes blueberries? Um, so... I'll be able to like help him around the house. I'm gonna see what he's doing today because I'm off. Um, I'm off today and Thursday, Friday. I think I work Saturday, Friday, Monday, whatever. I work all the time. I'm gonna work all the time. But um, yeah, it's good. It's good that my parents live in like a high rise where they use an elevator, so that'll be easier because he won't have to climb stairs. But still, like going to the bathroom. Getting out of bed, getting out of the couch. It's been a struggle for him, so I'm just happy he's okay. And nothing worse happened, you know? Like an impairable, um, non-surgical thing that they couldn't do. They were able to fix him up and send him on his way, so. Yeah, he's a strong man, really strong man, and he's my dad, and I love him, and he's the best man ever, so. I know if this would have happened to me, he would have did anything that he could to help me. So I just got to appreciate that he would do everything to help me. So I got to do everything I can to help him. So, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Mira que fea estoy. Shinga. Say hi, Momo. Momo's been a very bad boy, but it's because I left him alone a lot because I haven't been able to take him to my mom's house. Oh, also, we've had a rental for like, a rental car for like two weeks um alex got in a car accident thank goodness he's safe um the same week my dad freaking broke his knee alex got in a car accident but you know at least he's, he's safe too so just you guys so much negative shit has been happening to my family i swear someone put like brujeria on us because my like so much bad shit has been happening i'm just like what the hell is going on like i've been breaking down at work like what is going on it's crazy but anyways um the laura lee drama like what the hell is going on one of the girls that me and laura um well collab with me and laura and like so long ago um i think she blocked her on instagram i was just like what she's like what's going on with laura i can't find her on instagram so i went to go look and she's still on Instagram, but I'm like, maybe she blocked you. But I'm like, why? <laughs> you know, like, what the hell? And then her video of her crying and then Manny coming out with a video and then all this Jeffrey stuff. I'm just so confused. If you guys don't want to be friends and just be like, we're not friends and that's it. Like, you don't have to explain what happened, but you ca you kept such an open um, friendship and you guys went on trips and bought each other things and whatever and i feel like if you're gonna show all that to the, your viewers and you can't just tell your viewers you know something happened and we're not friends anymore and that's all you guys need to know that's what people want to hear they don't want to hear like the ring around like um oh yeah this person and this person but not saying their name directly you know it's crazy like we're not friends and that's it like what's so hard about that i get you're famous but you know these people are crazy like there's more important things in this world than just uh drama over makeup so when everybody was like hitting me up yesterday like if i knew all the time um so one of the girls yeah um i'll link her down below i think she makes bows now for little girls which is really cute and necklaces i don't know if she makes them or she like promotes them so i'll put her instagram down below and then my friend frida was like girl did you see laura's video of her crying i then i jumped on i saw her video and i was just like Híjole, pues, sí, this must be very fake because I don't believe it. Like, you could tell when you believe someone crying and, like, sincere. And, like, even if you're not crying, you believe someone when they're sincere. But that just looked a little suspicious. So, I'm going to leave you guys on that. I'm not going to put makeup on today. I'm just going to clean up the house um, and spend time with my dog because he's missed me and he's been crazy. And I've been breaking out everywhere, literally, like, it's just been, my life has been a mess. But he's the good boy, right? He literally ripped up floor, he ripped up my blinds, he ripped up everything. So, I'm trying to repair it. The My foot of the bed, like, one of the things where, um, 
the bed holds on to like uh, i don't know what it's called the bed frame it broke so we're like this so i have to look for that it's just so much i'm having alex's dad stay here next week um a few people want me to do their makeup uh if you guys didn't know i'm doing makeup now so if you guys want to hit me up hit me up okay i'll show you guys a price i still gotta make a price list but we can negotiate um and yeah so that's pretty much all that's been going on it's been just hard like you guys i don't want to pick up a phone and just vlog myself just being sad because i don't want that even though i am very open with you guys i just needed those like two weeks to help my family so yeah yes <laughs> i'll see you guys later i love you so much and i'll see you bye